K-Drama Remakes 2021. 2021 is a year of remakes and Korean production companies are investing not only for the remakes of past Korean dramas and films, but also from popular dramas around the world. Remaking a drama is not new in the Korean industry. Just like Taiwanese dramas, it started with a kiss. Chinese dramas, Moon Lovers, which adapted into Scarlet Heart Rayo. Japanese dramas, Hana Yori Dango. And American series, Suits, Criminal Minds, and many more. But in 2021, aside from webtoons being made as dramas, remakes of movies and dramas are also popular. Here are some of the confirmed dramas to have a Korean remake. Number 1. Mr. Hong Shin min -ah and Kim Sun ho are both to play the main lead roles in the upcoming remake of the 2004 Korean film Mr. Hong. The film will be turned into a drama, and the remake will be called Hometown Cha-Cha-Cha. From the movie, the story revolves around Hong do shik who's an all-around and can do a lot of things. He has different kinds of jobs from day to night. The drama remake of Mr. Hong will be written by Shin ha Eun, who also helmed The Crowned Clown. Hometown Cha-Cha-Cha aims to air on TVN in August 28, 2021. Number 2. Undercover The hit 2016 BBC series, Undercover, has six episodes that showcases the lives and family of Maya Kubina, played by Sophie Okonedo. The Korean remake of Undercover will showcase the story of Hang Jun Hyun and Chae Young So. Actor Jin Ji Hee will play the role of Hang Jun Hyun, an agent with the National Intelligence Service, who hides his real identity. And Kim Hyung Joo will play the role of Chae Young So, the senior civil servant corruption investigations unit, the human rights lawyer, who's seeking for justice. This remake drama will also be the reunion of Ji Jin Hee and Kim Hyung Joo, four years after their work in I Have a Lover. If you missed them, give this video a like. Number 3. Goon after all the news about remakes, this one made everyone excited, not only the Korean viewers but also fans from all over the world, who also watched the drama series and possibly read that beautiful manhwa that the story was based on. After 15 years, it is confirmed that the phenomenal drama will have its remake. The production company who was in charge of the 2006 drama and its rights, Group 8 and Jedam Media, has signed the contract for the remake. Goon aired in 2006 with the main leads Ju Ji Hoon, Yoon Eun Hae, Song Ji Hyo, and Kim Jun Hoon. The drama garnered more than 26% in ratings back then. Goon will narrate the story of a normal high school girl who has no choice but to agree to the arranged marriage agreement between her grandfather and the former king of Korea, as she set to marry the young prince, is based around the concept if Korea still had an ongoing monarchy, what it would be like in modern times. Many are already anticipating the remake, and drama fans have been suggesting who's going to be a part of the cast of the hit drama. We are just on the third remake of the list, and there's still a few more to go. If you want to know more, make sure you click the like button and keep on watching. Number 4. The Silent Sea Did you know that the upcoming Netflix series The Silent Sea will actually be a remake of the 2014 movie The Sea of Tranquility? The original movie was written and directed by Chae Hang Young. For the upcoming remake, he will be in charge of directing, and the script will be written by Park Eun Kyo, who has also helmed the film Mother. It will be produced by actor Jung Woo Sung, and it will exclusively be available on Netflix. The Silent Sea is a sci-fi horror thriller that is set in the far future where the Earth is experiencing a shortage in food and water. Due to desertification, a special team will work together to find the mysterious samples from an abandoned research station on the moon. The confirmed cast of Star in the Silent Sea are Gong Yu, Bei Duna, and Lee Jun. The airing of The Silent Sea is not yet confirmed, and filming of the series is still ongoing. Number 5. Money Heist The famous Netflix series Money Heist will also be having a Korean remake, and the cast is almost complete. Actor Yoo Ji Tae will play as Professor, Kim Yoon Jin as Lisbon, and Jun Jun So will play as Tokyo. Park Hae So got the offer to play the role of Berlin, and Kim Ji Hoon as Denver. Money Heist, also known as La Casa de Papel, is a Spanish crime drama that depicts the story of a group of people led by Professor, who has planned the biggest heist in history. The Korean remake will have the same plot, but instead the setting will be in the Korean peninsula. Number 6. 
Phoenix 2020. Aired in October 2020, and it's expected to end in April 2021. Phoenix 2020 is a remake of the Korean drama with the same name that aired in 2004, with main leads Lee Eun-ju, Lee So-jin, Eric Moon, and Jung Hae-young. Phoenix was among the top-rated Korean dramas that aired on NBC in 2004, with ratings of over 25%. The story revolves around the romance between a Shebal's conglomerate daughter and a man who comes from an underprivileged family. Despite the odds, the two got married. After several conflicts, the two eventually ended their marriage. Ten years later, their fates reverse, and the man is now successful. When they meet again, they both have different partners, and this will start their intertwined fates of four people's love. Main cast of the remake include Hong Soa, Lee Jae-woo, Sa ha Jun and Park Young Rin. Number 7. Someday or One Day. The only Taiwanese series that will have a Korean remake, for now, is the 2019's hit drama Someday or One Day. Someday or One Day will narrate the life of a 27 year old woman played by Alice Key, who misses her partner, played by Greg Su. She keeps on hanging on to the idea that he will contact her, so she frequently checks her social media. One day, she woke up trapped in the past and in another person's life. She tries to change the destiny of Chen Young Ryu. The drama became a hit in Taiwan together with its OST. It ranked first for its time slot for 12 consecutive weeks, with 4.16% in viewership ratings. It also achieved over 1 billion views worldwide through OTT platforms such as IQIYI, Taiwan, Line TV, My Video, Viki, and more. In Korea, it was released through cable channel We Like and Wave and atop the Asian charts. NPIOE Entertainment and Leon Contents will be the producer for the Korean remake. There's no other details revealed yet and no confirmed broadcasting network and airing dates. Number 8. The Mentalist Lee Shi Young and Park Shi Hu are reportedly starring in the Korean remake of The Mentalist. In the original US TV version, the story will unfold as Patrick Jane assists the police as he tracks down the serial killer who murdered his wife and daughter with the use of his psychological tricks. The Korean remake will be directed by Pyo Min So, who also worked for The Producers and Full House. Number 9. Criminal Justice BBC One television series Criminal Justice will have its Korean remake, and with just the main leads, it's already expected to become a hit. Cha Sung Wang and Kim So Hyun will be the main leads for the upcoming remake. The title will also be changed and will be called That Night. It will depict the story of two men getting involved in a murder case. Kim So Hyun will play the role of a normal college student and will unexpectedly become the main suspect of a murder. Cha Sung Wang will play the role of a lawyer who barely passed the bar exam and the only person who is interested in extending a helping hand to Kim So Hyun's character. That Night will start shooting in the first half of the year and it will air in the second half of 2021. This will surely be on our watch list. Aside from dramas, there's also a few movies that will have its Korean remake. Exo's Do Kyung So will be the main lead for the upcoming remake movie, Secret. Another movie that will have a remake is Soulmate, starring Kim Da Mi. Are there any previous Korean or foreign works you wish to have a remake of? Let us know about them in the comment section down below. I would be curious to see what a remake of Full House would be like. Thanks for watching, MDLers. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'm your host at Happy Squeak. So I kind of have some allergies on the go, so my voice is a little bit affected. Probably you can hear it's a little raspier than usual.